Hey everybody, this is Rykard here again, and welcome to another Pokemon sets video, this time featuring Delcaddy. I have three sets for this Pokemon for you all today, so let's get started like we always do by taking a look at this Pokemon's typing, abilities, and stats. So to start things off, Delcaddy is a normal type Pokemon introduced into Generation 3, and is unfortunately a Pokemon you really don't see too often in competitive battles. But the first of its three abilities is known as Cute Charm, which is an ability that has a 30% chance to infatuate your opponent if they hit you with a contact move and are of the opposite gender. So there are a lot of requirements for this ability to actually be effective, but when it works, it's really frustrating for the opponent because they are attracted to you, meaning that they only have a 50% chance to even attack on the turns that they are moving. Um, as for your second ability, though, it is known as Normalize, which is an ability unique to Delcaddy and Skitty, which is an ability that makes it so that all of your attacks, regardless of what type they actually are, are of the normal type. So for example, if you're using Thunder Wave, which is normally an electric move, it is actually a normal type move with a normalized ability, meaning you can actually paralyze ground types with Thunder Wave, which is really cool. The unfortunate side effect of this, though, is that you cannot hit ghost types at all with this ability, which is very frustrating. And also, if you had the idea of poisoning steel types, because Toxic is technically a normal type move if you're using Normalize, that actually does not work, because I tried it out, because I thought that would have been really cool. Um, but unfortunately, it doesn't work because steel types are just immune to poison in general, so they cannot be inflicted with that status, unless, of course, you soak them first, but that's a story for another day. As for its last ability, it is known as Wonder Skin, which is a really awesome ability that I feel should have been distributed more so among other Pokemon, so I'm hoping more Pokemon actually have this in 6th gen. But Wonder Skin is an ability that decreases the accuracy of any type of status move by 50%, meaning that a move like... For, or for example, Thunder Wave, which normally has 100% accuracy, will only actually have 50% accuracy because Wonder Skin reduces its accuracy. Meaning that you can actually just come in on status moves and hope they miss because there's a very good chance that they will, which is a really cool thing that Delcaddy can do. But as for its stats, it has base 70 HP, base 65 defense, and base 55 special defense for its defenses, meaning that this Pokemon is not terribly bulky. Um, unfortunately, it won't be able to take hits that well regardless of the EVs that you put into it. Which is actually very unfortunate because Delcaddy has an amazing support move pool. So there is a possibility for a set like that, but it'll probably more so be outclassed by a lot of other Pokemon that can do the same thing with better defenses, unfortunately. As for its attacking stats though, it has base 65 attack, base 55 special attack, and also base 70 speed, which means it's pretty quick, but isn't too offensive either. Base 65 physical attack though isn't that bad, um, and also, it does have ways to boost both its physical and special attack in the form of workup and also Calm Mind for the special attack, and even a special defense boost as well. So, there are options to increase its attacking power, but it might need to set up first for you to allow it to do a ton of damage in battle. But, with that, let's take a look at the first set that I have for you in this video. So, for this first set, we're going to start by giving Delcaddy an Adamant Nature to increase its physical attack and lower its special attack, or a Jolly Nature to increase its speed but lower its special attack. I personally prefer Adamant just because you are running a lot of priority on this set, but if you want to go with Jolly just for a little bit more speed, that will help you in using one of your only attacks on the set that does not rely on priority or isn't like a support move of any kind, so there is that option. But as for the ability, we're going to be going with Normalize to make all of our moves normal type, and for the EVs, we're going to be putting 252 into our physical attack, 4 for our special defense, and 252 EVs into our speed, to give us our max physical attack and speed possible with whichever nature you choose, obviously. And for the item, we're either going to go with a Silk Scarf because the only type your moves will be are normal types, so Silk Scarf will definitely increase that. And there's also no side effect of using Silk Scarf, whereas with Life Orb, you do get a little bit more power, but there is the negative side effect of the recoil that using a Life Orb provides. But whatever you do, do not run an Expert Belt on a normalized Delcaddy. As for the moves, though, the first one we're going to go with is Fake Out to basically give us a priority in the form of a move that could also flinch. Um, it's a really good move to just come in and use, um, and it's really great for doing damage to any Pokemon that is at low health or is toxic, so you can flinch them, they take more toxic damage, and also just anything faster than Delcaddy, to be completely honest. The next move on the set, though, is going to be Sucker Punch, because of Normalize, it's not a dark type, it's a normal type move. So Sucker Punch essentially functions as extreme speed on this set. Same base power, not the same priority, and also Sucker Punch will not work if your opponent does not use an attack move. But it's still really good to have an 80 base power normal type move, quote unquote, on this set that is priority. The next move that you can go with is either going to be Return or Retaliate, 
Return will be your strongest move regardless of what happens, but Retaliate could also be really great if you want to bring Delcaddy into Revenge Kill because its normal 70 base power will be boosted to 140 base power if you bring it in after one of your uh, or one of your own Pokemon dies. So there is that option as well if you want to go with it. And after the last move on the set, you can run a support move on Delcaddy, which is really good because since your only moves on this set are normal type, it might be a good idea to just run an extra move to support your team a little bit. So you could either run Wish on this set to obviously pass off health to the or to another member of your team, or you could run Thunder Wave as a way to just paralyze things. Obviously you cannot paralyze ghost types because Thunder Wave is a normal move, however you can paralyze ground types as I said before in the intro, so there is that option if you want to go with it. Um, I also think this works th uh, through Lightning Rod and Volt Absorb as well, which is really cool. Um, so for example if the Zeb Striker comes in to take a Thunder Wave it won't do it or something like that. Um, but either way this is just a really solid set to use on Delcaddy for priority purposes to do a lot of damage and revenge kill extremely effectively. As for this next set, we're going to start by giving Delcaddy a Timid Nature to increase its speed but lower its physical attack, and for the ability, we're going to be going with Wonder Skin this time. As for the EVs, we're going to put 252 into our special attack, 4 for our special defense, and then 252 EVs into our speed to give us our max special attack and max speed possible with the Timid Nature. And as for the item, you can either go with a Life Orb to significantly increase your damage output on this set, or a Leftovers, or, or Leftovers, sorry, to increase your survivability because you'll be recovering HP every turn which will also allow you to baton pass more effectively since this is a baton pass set for uh, Delcaddy to use. But for the first move on the set you could either go with workup to increase your physical attack and special attack or calm mind to increase your special attack and special defense. Both of these moves work the same for Delcaddy so it's more what you want to be baton passing out to another teammate if you ever have to. So Workup is great because regardless of what type of attacker they are, it will benefit them because it will increase both their physical and special attack, whereas Combine is limited really only to other special attackers or a Pokemon that could really benefit from a special defense boost. So it's, it's whichever one you want to go with and it's really up to you to decide on what benefits your team the most. But as for the other moves on the set, the first move that we're going to go with on the set is either going to be Hyper Voice or Ice Beam. Hyper Voice obviously is the most damaging move you could go for um, other than Hyper Beam from the special normal side for Delcaddy to use. But Ice Beam would also be really great on the set because along with your secondary attacking move which is Thunderbolt, you could run the Bolt Beam combo which is really unresisted by most other Pokemon especially in NU. Now this is important to note because even though you aren't getting Stab on the set if you do run Ice Beam and Thunderbolt, you are getting much better type coverage so that is kind of a decision you do have to make with the set. And then for the last move on this set, we're also going to be using Baton Pass, as I mentioned before, to pass out any boosts that you may acquire to another member of your team so that they can do more damage or take hits more so from the special defensive side. Baton Pass also could work as a mini U-turn without really any damage benefits if you feel that you won't really be able to get up a boost but want to get an advantage in battle by switching out as your opponent makes an actual switch. So it's an option if you want to go with it. Uh, but this is the special variant of this set for Delcaddy, so let's go ahead and take a look at the last set for this video, which is the physical one. So as for this last set, we are going to be going with a giant nature this time to increase your speed but lower your special attack, and for the ability we are again going to be going with Wonder Skin. As for the EVs, we're going to put 252 into our physical attack this time, as opposed to our special attack like in the previous set, 4 for our special defense, and then 252 EVs into our speed to give us our max physical attack and max speed possible with the giant nature. And for the item, again, you have the option of either picking a Life Orb or Leftovers. Life Orb, obviously, for increased damage. Leftovers for increased survivability and an easier time of potentially baton passing the boosts you accumulate to another member of your team. But for the moves on the set, since it does have to be changed up quite a bit since it is the physical variant, we are going to be going with Workup since, is the only way, or since this is the only way that Delcaddy has a way of boosting its physical attack. Now it does also boost your special attack, like I've said before, so you can pass these boosts off to a special attacker as well, and they will definitely benefit from that, even though your intent is to boost your own physical attack. Um, but for the actual attacking moves, we're going to be going with Return as your basic main uh, normal type move to go with. It's very strong, 1 on 2 base power if you have max happiness, so you can't really go wrong with that. Um, and then we're going to be going with Sucker Punch, which luckily this time is actually a dark type move, so it will allow you to actually hit ghost types, which is very good. Um, also, it's really great to have the priority, especially once you've accumulated some stat boosts, because that means you will be able to revenge kill things very effectively because of your increased priority. And also the last move on the set, as I've said numerous times already, 
is going to be baton pass to pass out boosts to other members of your team. But with that, let's take a look at a clip that I have of me using this set in battle against a subscriber who was nice enough to allow me to upload this for the sake of this video. So to start things off, i show you how I sucker punch this Zeb Strika since it's at low health to take it out. Now Aloma Mola comes in so I don't feel too threatened, go for a workup, but as he goes for a wish, I'm like, you know what, I should probably return in case he passes it out to something with low health which is exactly what he does, and I take out the Ludicolo. But now his Regirock comes in, and knowing that it's burned, I know that I could do whatever to it and just continue to set up. He goes for a Thunder Wave right there, and you saw that it missed because of Wonder Skin, which is really cool to just point that out. But either way, he now has me paralyzed and is going to continue to try and para flinch me. Luckily, though, I actually get to Baton Pass out this turn, which means that I'm able to actually go into my Sock after I've done a bit of damage with Delcaddy. But now, since I have a Scarf Sock at plus 3, I'm pretty much able to just sweep through the rest of his team, Aloma Mola, though, is just one beast. Look at this. It lives a plus three close combat because it's just so defensive. That What an awesome Pokemon. But anyway, um, it does die on the second turn, though, however, because it wouldn't have been able to wish protect all day because you know, I was just doing too much damage for it to be able to. But anyways, that's pretty much how that entire set works in a nutshell. I showed you the priority. I showed you me attacking and boosting and then baton passing out to basically something that can sweep for the remainder of the battle. So Delcaddy is definitely a very capable Pokemon, even though you don't see it too often, but I definitely think it has a lot going for it, even though there are maybe other Pokemon that can do similar things a little bit better because they might have better stats or better moves or something like that. But either way, I hope you give any of these sets a shot and let me know what you think. Um, that is it for this video, everyone. So as always, take care, goodbye, and I will see you all next time.